Is it about changing the, the world? problem that's right Or is it your you? generation's time? Let's find out. This moment in time is historic. The power of one person to make change is unprecedented. The age of how is the best possible name I could actually think of for where kids are right now. This is the time when this generation can actually solve huge problems because they're invested in the way in which they're shaped going forward. The age of how is not an obstacle, it's a call to action. This moment in time is going to be the moment where we look back on and say, this is what revolutionized the world. I'm the special representative to Muslim communities and I work at the US Department of State. <laughs> This is the first time in American history that we have such a position, and I'm really honored to have it. We need to remind ourselves that diversity requires effort, effort on everyone's part, to be willing to learn and to respect differences. When I think about what I was like when I was a teen, of course, I had things that I was passionate about too. I was really interested in foreign affairs, in the sense of what is it that we can do to build a better world? And at the essence of what it is that most humans want to do, they want to do something that's actually going to add value, not take away. Um, and so when I think about the impact a young person can have now, they don't have to wait until they're in a senior government position. They can actually move their ideas forward. More people are listening to this generation. That's why it's called the youth quake, because things are happening. Things are shaking themselves up. One of the things I think is really wonderful that I want to focus on is that it's not where you're from, it's not what color your skin is, it's not what your name sounds like, it's not what religion you are. Young people are interested in ideas. That's extremely powerful. Secretary Clinton has asked me to work with our embassies around the world on a people-to-people -people level. And what does that mean? It means that you get to meet the people that are on the ground, in the grassroots, in the community, at a local level. When I travel around the world, I meet many young people who come to me with ideas uh, and also projects that they're working on that may seem small on a local level, but actually their ideas can be replicated in other parts of the world. This is a really special generation and I feel very lucky to be able to talk with it and to share ideas and impact the way in which we think about the future because we're listening to what this generation is saying is important to them. So when you see the ripple effect, what we call a youth quake or a tech quake, how you use technology, how youth are speaking, how youth are using their vibrancy and their ideas, to not wait for an older generation to tell them that their idea is okay, but to rather look around, figure out what needs to be done, and harness the energy that they have as young people, using the technology that they have to share stories, to share ideas, to build networks of like-minded thinkers. I get inspired when I meet young people. I really am activated by their energy and their passion for making the world better. We are watching ideas magnify in ways we couldn't possibly imagine. When a young person comes to me and says, I'm not waiting for someone else to do it, I'm doing it myself, we capture their stories and we spread them around the world. And we connect people who are interested in the same, same kinds of things to each other. Being able to be digitally connected means that there's no divide. It means that you're all connected at the same level, at, no matter what your socioeconomic background is, no matter what your education level is, no matter where in the world you are, you are able to be connected. And that's what makes this generation so distinct. But I have to say, it also gives this generation tremendous responsibility, in my view, to do more than they think that they can, because they have the tools to, to bring things forward very powerfully, very quickly.